Hello YouTube fans. I'm making pink HQ doing a bit of sorting. I've got a friend and I say, what kind of day have you had today? And she says, I've been counting Rue's nappies. <laughs> and if you know Winnie the Pooh, you'll know that Rue and Kanga. And Kanga's counting Rue's nappies. She's talking about it being like an organising sort of a day. So I've spent the better part of this morning doing just that. I had a lovely visitor yesterday. And um, she's just a really, really nice person. And we chatted on about all sorts of things. And the upshot of it is that I've had a major clear out in the shop. I've tweaked it and turned everything around a bit. So hopefully it's a little bit easier to navigate and it's all down to this friend of mine. Thank you. Uh, it was a little confusing in the shop. It isn't now. But also in doing that, um, I've listed a few new things. Now tomorrow uh, is Monday. It's Sunday today. I'm about to go out in the garden. It's the most beautiful day. I'm going to do some garden prep. But tomorrow, a little bit of a trailer showing you how to make these little um, this little block that makes this lavender bag. It smells absolutely divine. So there's some lavender bags here, but also uh, I've listed some of the uh, ceramics in the shop uh, because I came home from pottery on Friday. Some of you who follow me on Instagram will have seen all the pots that I brought home that I've made over the last few weeks. Well, I've listed some of them in the shop. So they're over there in the shop if you want to have a look at them. Um, there's just a few, not many, just a few. So they're over there. And also, I think I've made the cards a lot, lot easier to uh, navigate your way through. But the, I suppose the big exciting news for this little heads up is this. These are back in print now. So Kate's Cat Norma which some of you will have, uh, but I sold out of these. I've had another print run done, and so I've added those into the shop as well. The way that you can buy the books is you can buy the books one at a time, or you can buy a whole bundle of them at a reduced price. Uh, also, I think the other thing to say about um, if you do nip over to the shop is that there is a code... Uh, that you can use. I think it's called, in fact it is, it's called Share the Joy. And if you spend over £75, there's free shipping on everything over that. And so uh, sometimes people do spend uh, money like that and don't notice that there is actually a code. I've tried to add that into every listing. So I've been counting Rue's nappies. <laughs> Here up in Pink HQ then, uh, the map over my shoulder is getting more and more pins on every time my son comes. Um, but he's due to come again because I have a lot of... Anytime anyone buys anything from the shop, you go on this list. And when John comes, you end up being pinned onto the board. Well, there's pages and pages of them uh, waiting for John to come. He's a busy guy. Uh, and uh, so, uh, you know, no, no pressure on, on John there. So this is um, this is Pink HQ. There are uh, six different packs of cards for sale still. There are, uh, let me show you. So the packs of cards then, they are five in a pack, all different. It's all explained in the shop. You can see what each of the images are. There's a pack of flowers, a pack of sunsets, a pack of last homely house, all around and about here. Then there's a pack of poultry with five different poultry pictures in. Cats, of course, and crafts. All the lovely things that I like to do around and about here. So there's a pack of those, uh, uh, of each of those six different things. And then the books then. So in addition to a new print run of Kate's Cat Norma, there's a book about Eileen, Kate's Goose Eileen. 
There's a book about my bees. Another one about how the last homely house came to be the last homely house. This one is about my beautiful cat Sadie. Now this one was written when um, she was about to have her kittens. Now those kittens are nearly a year old. I'm going to do a little video, I hope, uh, the roundup about what they're all doing now. This book is the story of my friend. And this one is all about a job I did a few years ago, helping women make quilts in a rather interesting place. So they're all described there over on the um, over in the shop. Uh, the little pots, uh, there's some little nesting pots as well. This is all the stuff that I brought back from Pottery on Friday. And um, I've got so many of them. It would be really nice to share them about. Just a thing about the pots. They're heavy-ish. They're expensive to send. And also, I've had a couple of people who've ordered pots from me where they've broken in the post. I do my absolute best to pack them really, really carefully with loads of um, packing material in a rigid box. But still, I don't know what happens in some uh, post office depots. I think they must drive a steamroller over them. However, I've just bought this tape. I haven't opened it yet. Let's have a look inside here. If anybody buys ceramics from me, then this will be all over the outside of the box where the address isn't. Miles of this stuff. I've got six. <laughs> so, fragile. Fragile. All over your pots. I'll do my absolute best to send them and pack them really carefully. So, uh, oh, and another thing about pottery... I, said, I think I said something, uh, as this is going to be a short video, I said something in the uh, sticking the fabric on the box video about me and Pottery Parting Company. That's not going to happen. It just means that I might not go to the college uh, into the uh, future. I might sort something else. I have a very interesting plan B uh, uh, lined up. And so I'd say uh, uh, watch this space and I'll tell you all about that. OK, then. So. Here is um, uh, the last homely house, Pink HQ, the shipping room. I'm going to the post office tomorrow uh, because um, I've got a, uh, quite a few orders for books and cards. Thank you. But now we can add these extra products in as well. Oh, I'll be sad when I... I'll have to keep a couple of these, I think, because the smell is amazing. And uh, I sent uh, these were the um, Patreon um, gifts for last month. And um, <laughs> one of the uh, patrons who received it said that the postman remarked on how amazing his van smelled <laughs> because the smell was just it's very fresh, new lavender. It's absolutely gorgeous. So there you are. The block description is coming tomorrow, Monday. Uh, because that's part of the Liberty series and that's when they post. So I'll I'll stop wittering on now. I'm going to do lots of gardening today. My daughter's coming over, which will be absolutely lovely. And we're going to uh, just weeding. There's lots and lots of weeding to do. So I shall get on and do some of that and maybe plant the tomatoes. So I hope you're all having a wonderful Sunday. I know that in America it's actually Mother's Day, isn't it? It's Mother's Day in March here in the UK. And so if you are in a country where you're celebrating Mother's Day today and you are a mother or have a mother, which is pretty much everybody, isn't it? And if you're remembering a mother, maybe like I'm remembering my mother, uh, you know, who passed away uh, about 18 months ago now. And, you know, I'm reminded of her every day, especially any time I do anything with fabric. I'm reminded of her every day. So whether you're celebrating with your mother or remembering your mother or you are a mother, congratulations. You're awesome. <laughs> OK, guys, uh, that's it. I just wanted to pop along and uh, remind you what was going on there. And uh, now I've got to say it's the most beautiful day. I'm going out in the garden. So I'll catch up with you soon. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> with the Liberty um, uh, Liberty postage stamp block that's coming tomorrow. Thank you. Bye now.